Go ahead. Keith Nelson remembers taking his son to kindergarten like it was yesterday. That was the day his wife noticed something wasn't right. Ryan has Asperger's, which is a type of autism. The disorder is characterized mainly by difficulties in social interaction, a diagnosis that the new parents took hard. They actually said that he would never learn to read and he wouldn't um, be able to be, go to school. And this is um, Emmett Smith. He's the league's all-time leading rusher. I got this as a Christmas present for my dad. But 29-year-old Ryan Nelson is everything the doctors said he wouldn't be. Part of Ryan's success is being in a big family where we didn't have time to coddle him. It's always been like, I'm sorry you have a little disability, but you have to get up and you know get going. He's helped me try to motivate myself every day to do better. Ryan is your typical young adult. He gets nervous when you talk about his girlfriend. You man, my man at work. She asked him out. And he loves sports. Yeah, that cowboy cave, yeah. But his passion is floor hockey. It's one of my favorite sports. And his dad is right there with him. Drop, there you go. The coach of the Riverside Mad Dogs. I enjoy the time spending with them. The group of Special Olympic athletes chosen to represent the United States at the World Games. When I first started coaching, I told them, I said, if, if we commit to doing something, big things will happen. The team has been preparing for the big games since March. Everybody's hungry. I'm hungry for a gold medal. And they're not going to settle for second place. It took hard dedication, so they deserve this trip. We, we can't be stopped. As for Ryan, he's ready to protect USA's gold. He's won every game he's been in the net. And help bring his team closer to gold. We've tried to teach him that to be champions in everything they do. Hey, get it up! Champions on three! One, two, three, go!